apologize. All, all I was trying to say is that at the moment you're playing by the same rules. Otherwise, Karnataka, uh, you know, would not have happened in the way that it is. You can you make the point that you need to change uh, the, the 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 rules. Uh, but uh, but yes, okay, you don't fully. But agree. we're playing by the constitution. We're playing by the constitution that okay. is in India. I, that that is that I, is our legacy. Everyone that wants to react. Doing. Everyone wants to react to what you've said. I'll give Tehseen one sentence, then Dr. Tayal, Anurag, and then Dilip in that order. Tehseen, brief interjection, then Dr. Tayal. Yeah. No, no, Tehseen. I completely agree with Salman. I completely agree with Salman. BGP is a massive advantage. We know all of that. That's true. But the fact is, and I also agree with them. We need to change the rules. There were so many advantages that, and and despite the ma massive advantage the BGP has, data shows us that Prime Minister Modi himself cannot take the BJP to a guaranteed victory in state elections. He's losing popularity, not in Lok Sabha, but in state. We know the data shows us. Despite a massive advantage, the BJP, except in Uttar Pradesh and few sits in Madhya Pradesh, don't cross 50%. The opposition is very strong. The point is the opposition needs to now, as Salman said, play another game. Let me forget the, all the advantages the opposition has. Let me ask with one example. 146 MPs thrown out of parliament in the most crude manner. And, and in my opinion, very draconian bills passed. What did the opposition do? The country politically should have come to a standstill. What did the opposition do? You can't blame anybody else. Mock, mock the vice president. They took a chakkar around Jantar Mantar. Think if 146 BJP MPs were kicked out. And Salman will agree with me. The country, Dilip will agree with me. The country would have come to a standstill. We Jantar Mantar ka chakkar mara nahi mock the vice president. 146 hmm. MPs. Think about it. What okay. okay. Dr. Tayal, Dr. Tayal, the shadow of the Chandigarh mayor elections, and I, I know you, you know, given that the case is in court and all of that, you won't say much about it, but I reference it only to say that it is added to this allegation that comes from the Congress that the BJP will do anything. This is not a fair and square contest of equals anymore, the misuse of the ED and the CBI, Akhilesh Yadav summons by the CBI. How do you respond? 9th May 2013, Congress was in power and the Supreme Court said CBI is a caged parrot. So Mr. Soz uh, can refer to that. So, I mean, where he says we come from a legacy, I think the legacy is of a caged parrot. So let's be very clear on that count. So, mm -hmm. I mean, the party, the party of the emergency is talking about um, high, high, high morals. Let's understand. So today they're saying it's no longer a level playing field. Yes, it isn't. This is the two member party which has grown itself on its own strength and their fantastic leadership has taken a 400 MP party to a 44 MP party. I, like I said at the beginning of the or, or, you know, or, or of this uh, program, that the answers lie within. Mr. Okay. Uh, Singhvi, Mr. Singhvi has said, "Jab wo khada karta hai ek aur is tarah ke candidate ko, to ek hi sandesh hai. They are up to something. So you knew kya sandesh hai. Or two days pehle ab waha pahunch ke apne socha kam ho jayega. Are you playing politics? He, uh, Mr. Soos said, you know, BJP wants to win all the seats. Yes." Congress Mukt Bharat Karna. What are you going to do about it? Don't expect arms from us. We, we're not that charitable. We're not going to give arms to anybody. Come right out. Let's have it. Let's have it out. So to say it's not a level playing field, we created the field for ourselves. Please let us see the alpha in you. What are you going to create? So yeah. if your people are not working hard or your leadership is incapable of delivering today, the Gandhi family is looking for a constituency. Amethi he can't go to, Vainard is gone. I mean, the leader is looking for a constituency, doesn't have a constituency. Open challenge from Smriti Rani, come to Amethi, only contest Amethi, let us see what you are made of. And I bet he will not take it up, he cannot. Okay, so let's get responses to that. Yeah, Why will the people not leave? People will abandon, the ship is sinking. Yeah, let's. Uh, I, th I think you make a fair point about the self made journey of the BJP. The Tessie the made this point as a Congress supporter that you know you need to go back to playing the game or play a different game, but you have to play to win. Uh, you can't play to be an also ran. Uh, and that's that's the point. Now, Anurag, you wanted to come in and then I'll give the leap maybe the last word. Yeah. Yeah, three quick points, Barkha. Yeah. You know, Tessie mentioned about the changing the rules, you know. You, you can't change the rules because you're not able to win. You have to first win in this game or do fairly good and then talk about changing the thing. Be there and then change the thing. That's what that's how it works. 
and uh, so basically you have out. to win to change the rules of the game of you course have to, you have to be you there power. I mean, yeah, who's exactly. gonna, yeah of course you have to, and second yeah. second uh, salman spoke about you know bjp has media and you know you know salman if your high command is not able to give appointment to his leaders media cannot do anything for it no barkha cannot call rahul gandhi ki bhaiya aap vikramaditya ko appointment do na no? so rahul has to give appointment to vikramaditya barkha cannot do anything for that so another thing you know dilip mentioned very good point about you know this display of arrogance just adding to that but yeah. barkha what i feel about congress is addition to arrogance it is carelessness you may you may feel careless at least don't show that carelessness i mean with rahul what i see is you may feel that you know i don't care about anything at least don't show in your body language it demoralizes the whole party cadre it brings down the fighting spirit in your leaders when you say ha bhai har gaye hum we will talk about bada change salman talked about hum naya game dhoondenge hum ye karenge these are all you know be in today be today and talk about today that is what going to motivate your leaders if you talk something that your leaders cannot understand on the ground or the western I, advisors I, are advising you You, I mean, the country cannot do anything for it. I, I, I want to address the elephant in the room uh, with apologies to Salman, who may think I'm being unfair here. But to Dilip, I ask the the question. Mr. Gandhi is not in the country. Priyanka Gandhi Vadra said to be working the phone lines right now. Um, the point is, the Congress says Rahul Gandhi is a soft target for the media. So I'm just going to ask one question about this because there's a lot else to discuss. He's not here. Is that a problem? Hang on, Dilip. We need to unmute you. Yeah, now go ahead. Yeah, yeah. I think it is a problem that Rahul Gandhi is not here during a time of crisis. Mm-hmm. You have to have all hands on deck. There are no ifs and buts in politics and political management. Whether it's the corporate management that I do, the legal management that I do, one thing is certain that when there are situations of this kind, you dump. and drop everything and you're with your team leading from the front that is a big problem the second problem is that you need to actually be in this game 24 by 7 into 365 there are no choices when salman says that we need to change the game you first need to play this game 24 by 7 into 365 and yeah. only that will assure you a place at the table where you can start playing number 3 win anywhere you won x y z state please build out of there not try and cause confusion and complications even where you won the fact is that when you won a himachal or when you won a karnataka the congress tends to treat those people as milch cows and wants to just exploit it i think that even abhishek singhvi's nomination in himachal though salman says that you have the right to nominate from anywhere in the country the fact is that for a tiny state like that allowing an outsider to come and get the one rajya sabha seat there does stink it causes problems and then you created a fertile ground for the possibility of what actually happened yesterday well those are very strong words and i was going to end with them but i have a feeling salman might want to respond or tahseen certainly does so salman i'll maybe we'll just do another round of quick comments salman go ahead yeah you know i just want to uh, i just want to address uh, uh, the leaps point about uh, uh, rahul gandhi not being here and he had to be there 24/7 this the, this man has been walking all over the country for the last uh, i don't know for, for the last year all we've seen him do is pretty much walk 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 he shattered his knees walking to, uh, to with, with an idea in his mind trying to uh, uh, have some outreach that nobody nobody else uh, has done in this country at least in living memory so that's as far as him is uh, rahul gandhi rahul gandhi is concerned now he's not the only leader in the congress party mind you we have a congress president against 